Did you know that 6 out of 10 people prefer watching online video content compared to watching TV? And 9 out of 10 people said they want to see more videos from their favourite businesses and brands. As you can see there is a growing necessity for all shapes and sizes of businesses to adopt video marketing as a core component to their marketing strategy. Now getting started with creating videos for your business does not have to be daunting and it can actually be affordable, fun and easy for both experts and complete beginners. Hey team, Stuart here, welcome back to this channel and if it's your first time here then thanks for joining me. Now today I'm excited to share how you can simply create professional videos for your business in minutes using invideo.io. Now this intuitive and easy to use video editor allows you to browse from thousands of professional video templates that you can customize the way that you like to use in your video marketing activities. Now, we use InVideo.io nearly every day to create videos for our brand as well as for our clients. So today I'm going to share how you can ultimately grow your business by creating engaging and professional business videos. Okay, now before we launch into this InVideo tutorial, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already or if you're new to this channel and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge and tools to help your small business thrive online. And with that out of the way, let's go ahead and create professional videos for your business. Okay, so first before we go ahead and dive into this invideo.io tutorial, it's important to note that this is a sponsored video by our friends over at invideo.io. And because we use invideo.io nearly every day to quickly create video content for our clients as well as for our own brand, we decided that this would be a valuable partnership. So thank you invideo.io for sponsoring this video. Okay, so with that out of the way, let's go ahead and navigate through the process of simply creating videos for our business. Now to arrive at this invideo.io webpage, simply click the link in our description below this video and that's going to take you here. Now again, it's important to note that this link is an affiliate link, which means if you decide to upgrade to a paid plan through InVideo, then we will get a small commission and this just helps support our channel. So thank you so much in advance. And then once you've arrived at InVideo, simply navigate up to get started, it's free. Then go ahead and fill out your details to create a free account. What we're going to do is create a fresh new account for the purpose of today's tutorial. So once you've added all your information in there, simply go ahead and click create account. Then here, go ahead and select the best option that describes you. For me, I'm going to go ahead and select small company. Then once you've selected the best option that describes you, go ahead and click next. Now, one of the great things that we love about using InVideo as an all-in-one video editing platform is you can add unlimited users to a single account. So here, what you can do is go ahead and invite people that you want to collaborate with in terms of creating videos for your business. You can also go ahead and name your team. However, you can go ahead and do this later on if you like. So for now, what I'm going to do is click close. And just like that, we've arrived inside our InVideo account. Now, before we go ahead and dive into all the tools, features and elements that you can use to create videos for your business, it's important to discuss the premium paid plans that InVideo has to offer. So simply navigate up to upgrade and click here. Now, another reason we love talking about InVideo to our clients and audience is the fact that InVideo allows you to use all their premium features and tools completely for free. Once you've finished creating your videos, then you do need to upgrade to one of these paid plans in order to remove the no watermark on videos. The great thing about this, especially for beginners, is you can learn how to make the most of InVideo before paying anything. And then once you've fallen in love with InVideo like we have and you're ready to upgrade, you can choose to be billed annually with the business plan or unlimited plan 
or you can select monthly and you can be billed monthly. However, if you choose yearly, you do save six months. Basically, it's 50% off. And remember, you can upgrade at any time. You can upgrade now or you can play around with in video. Watch this in video tutorial all the way through to the end and then decide if you want to upgrade and use those videos that you've created. Just remember at checkout to use the code Stuart25 for a further 25% off. Okay, so what we're gonna do is navigate up here and close these plans for now and go ahead and start creating professional videos for our business. Okay, so let's get started by navigating through our InVideo dashboard. Now, if we head over to the left-hand side, you can see that we have pre-made templates selected. Basically, InVideo allows you to access over 5,000 completely customizable professional templates that you can use in your business videos. So you can basically find a template that works for your business, then you can customize that template the way that you like. This saves you so much time when creating video content, especially if you're creating short form video content for your social media channels and you're creating content every day then using templates is great because it dramatically reduces the time it takes to create videos. We find that the majority of our clients prefer using templates rather than building videos from scratch because a lot of them don't have any experience with actually creating videos, editing or designing videos. So templates are a great place to start. Now, you also don't just have access to thousands of pre-made templates to build from, but you can also access the stock library, the immense stock library that InVideo has to offer with more than 10 million professional stock videos and images for you to use in your videos. These are from premium sources like Shutterstock and iStock. Now, we can also navigate over to text to video and this feature allows you to select a pre-made video theme and then all you need to do is add your text and this feature will convert any of your text into an engaging video. And with a few clicks, you will have a custom video. Then you can further personalize that video by changing and editing the different elements on that video. Then if we navigate up to blank canvas, this is self-explanatory. Basically, you can create a video from scratch, but we recommend getting started with a pre-made template because with pre-made templates, this gives you an idea of how a professional video should be structured. And then you can simply customize all the different elements the way that you like by uploading your own videos, your own elements, images, and then crafting the video the way that you like with this super powerful and easy to use visual editor and timeline, which we're gonna dive into shortly. Now, if we navigate down here, we can search for specific pre-made templates that we want to use based on our type of business that we run or the type of video that we want to create. Then below that, we have select a dimension to get started. Now you have these three common options. We have wide. Now the wide format video is great for YouTube or large format videos. Then over here we have square. If we click on square, that's gonna bring up square pre-made video templates that we can choose from. Now, these could be video posts for social media like Facebook or Instagram or even Twitter. Then next to square, we have the vertical dimension. If we click here, that's gonna generate vertical format video templates that we can build from. Now, the vertical video format is a popular format across different social media platforms. For example, you could use vertical format videos for YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels or Stories, or even Facebook Stories. So basically, a vertical format takes up the entire screen of a mobile device. However, today, what I wanna do is select wide. Now, for the purpose of today's video, what I'm going to do is use the wide dimension, the wide format to create a video for our business. However, go ahead and choose wide, square or vertical. Now, the next thing we want to do is navigate up to the search bar. Then go ahead and simply type in a keyword that's related to the type of business that you run or the type of video that you want to create. 
For example, let's say we owned a yoga studio and we wanted to create content, video content around yoga. What I would do is simply type in yoga. And then we can see some suggestions down here. What I'm going to do is simply click yoga up here. And you can see that by typing in the keyword yoga, we have 26 templates that we can use. So if we navigate down here and hover our mouse over each of the templates, we can view a preview of what that video ad will look like. So we can navigate across each of these different templates to view each of these video templates before deciding if we want to use that template and customize it the way that we like. Now we can also click on the template and that's going to generate a larger preview of that video template. Then over here we have the options to select wide, square or vertical. Now depending on the way that pre-made template has been built, you may not be able to select these other formats. Now if you want to access different yoga formats, for example square or vertical, what you would do is scroll up to the top and then simply click square and that's going to generate all the square format templates for the keyword yoga. Now we can also navigate up here and head over to vertical to find the vertical yoga templates. And then again you can scroll through all these different vertical templates that we can use for our business. And like I mentioned all the different elements within each of these templates you can customize the way that you like. Now if we navigate back up to the top and locate the search bar again this time I'm going to type in real estate and then come down and I'm going to select real estate video and under the keyword real estate video you can see that there are over 1200 templates that we can choose from I'm going to navigate over to the wide format and then under the wide format you can see that there are over 1800 templates that we can choose from. So that's how you can navigate through all the different templates by typing in specific keywords related to your business, your brand, your products or services and then identifying the template that you want to further customize. Now for the purpose of today's tutorial let's say that I own a local gym and I want to create video content for my gym business. So what I would do is navigate up to the search bar and then simply type in gym and under suggested what I'm going to do is select gym promo. Then what I would do is simply navigate down the page and identify the video template that I want to use for my business. Now you need to identify what goal you want to achieve with your video. For example, do you want to create a promotional video? Do you want to create an education based video? Or do you want to create a video that's based on talking about your gym and what it has to offer? So for example, if I like the look of this video, what I would do is click here. And down here I can view a larger preview of what this video will look like. So I want to create a video that talks about our gym, all the amenities, all the benefits of using our gym. So if you like the look of the pre-made video template, simply navigate down and click use this template. Okay, so here we are inside InVideo's super powerful and easy to use visual editor and timeline. Now a new feature that they recently added is allowing you to switch templates so that you don't have to reset your project from scratch. So for example if you made changes to a bunch of elements on this template, you uploaded your own media, your own images or videos but you weren't too keen on the template then what you could do is actually switch to another template without starting your video project from scratch. All you would do is navigate over to templates, you can see that we have templates selected, then we would come down and locate the template that we want to switch to. For example, if I click on this gym poster promotion template, and then navigate up to use this template. Now before we go ahead and dive into the super powerful and easy to use visual editor, what I want to do is make sure that you're aware of InVideo's official YouTube channel. What I'll do is link their YouTube channel down below in our description. Basically what you want to do is follow their channel to stay updated with useful tips and tricks for creating videos for your business. So go ahead and follow InVideo if you're serious about improving your video editing skills. 
Okay, so now let's jump into creating our video in minutes using InVideo. Now here you can see our video itself. This is the template that we selected earlier. Now this video is made up of three scenes. So you can see we have the first scene here, the second scene over here, and the third scene over here. We can also navigate over to add a scene to add a blank scene, or we can go ahead and choose a template to add a fourth scene and you can add additional scenes if you like. Now with each of these scenes you can edit them the way that you like. So at the moment we have the first scene selected. We can navigate up here and see that this scene is six seconds long. We can edit that scene if we like and make it longer or we can make it shorter. We can also delete scenes if we like and then we can also duplicate scenes. So for example if we customize this scene here here, this part of the video and we wanted to duplicate that part of the video and then just make a few small changes for the second scene then all we would do is click duplicate so remember this is our timeline now down here we can see the music that is part of this video and again you can drag this music file to make it shorter or longer to fit your video or to fit specific scenes so for example if I clicked the audio or the music and then drag this all the way down to just the first scene then that means our first scene only has audio but what I want to do is make sure the entire video has audio by dragging the audio to the end of our third scene now if you like you can also simply add a voice over for your video and you have a few options for uploading and creating your voice over. Okay, so like I mentioned, we have the first scene selected over here. Now, if I navigate up to our video and click on this element here, so this is a text element. If I click here and then down here on our timeline, you can see that we have the text element selected and you can see the duration of that text element on our timeline. Now if we navigate back up here and on the right hand side you can see layers. Now down here you can see that we have this element selected. Now think about your layers as the top layer up here will be at the front of the screen. So if you had multiple layers overlapping each other on your scene you can simply drag those elements into the appropriate placement on your scene. So you can see the video is at the very back of this scene. Then we have the text background and then we have this text element over here. Now, if I wanted to change this text, all I would do is click on this element. And let's say, for example, I wanted to change this word up here, shape to define. All I would do is type in define. And then up on the top, you have formatting options available for each of your elements. So because this is a text element, I can change the color, the font size. I can also change the animation of the text if I like. So remember each of these elements you can customize. So on this scene, you can see that we have five elements, one, two, three, four, five. So again, for example, if I wanted to customize this element, all I would do is click here. And then again, I can come down to our timeline and I can change the duration of when this element shows in this particular scene, or I can navigate up to the top and format this text element the way that I like. Now, if we navigate over to the far left hand side, we have further options for customizing our video or our video template the way that we like. So for example, up here we have templates. We briefly talked about this. We can switch the template of specific scenes or the entire video. Then if we navigate down to uploads and click here, and this is where you can simply drag and drop to upload different media files. For example, videos or photos that you might have already recorded. Let's say I recorded a video at the gym and I wanted to replace this stock video with my own video. What I would do is simply upload that video in here and then simply drag and drop that video to replace this stock video in our first scene. So you can go ahead and upload your own media to use in your videos if you like. Then below uploads we have videos. If we click on videos, this is where you can search from millions of stock videos that you want to use in your video. 
So for example, if I wanted to replace this video here with a different stock gym video, then what I would do is navigate up to search videos and type in gym. And then I could simply select a video that I want to use. So for example, if I wanted to use this gym video here, all I would do is click and then drag and drop to replace this video with this new video. And then I have two options. I can either replace the video or I can add this video as a layer. What I wanna do is completely replace the video with the new video by clicking replace. And this is where you can preview your video. You can also trim the video so it fits the scene. This is exactly what we want to do because we want to replace the existing video in this scene. So go ahead and click trim video to fit scene. And then simply drag this scene to the area of the video that you want to capture. So I'm happy with this section of the video. Then when you're happy, come down and click done. And as you can see, we've replaced the original stock video with a new stock video by simply dragging and dropping that element. And then if we want to preview the scene, all we need to do is navigate down here and play the scene from the start. Now, if we want to view the entire video, so all three scenes, then what we would do is place the seeker all the way to the beginning of our video and then simply navigate up here and click play or you can hit the space bar to preview your video. Now, if we navigate back over to the left hand side and under video, we have images. If we click here, this similar to videos brings us to the millions of stock images that we can use in our videos. Again, you can go ahead and search the image and then simply drag and drop that image to replace elements or put that new image on your video. Then under images, we have music, and this is where you can search for specific music that you wanna use in your video. As you can see, if we navigate past our scenes, we have a song that has already been selected down here. What we can do is click edit, and we can go ahead and delete this song, and then choose a different song, a different track if we like, from the music available. And you can go ahead and search for the specific music that you're after for your video. Then below music, we have text. Now remember each of the elements on this left hand side, you can simply drag and drop into your video. Okay, so under text, this is basically where you can select the text and add that text into your video. Again, all you need to do is scroll through each of these different text elements and simply drag and drop those text elements onto your video. Now under text we have logo, and this is basically where you want to upload your logo for your business. And what's gonna happen is you can add that logo over to the logo section here, and that's gonna add the logo into every scene of your video. Now under logo we have colors, and this is basically where you can choose a template color to use for your video theme. Now, a helpful resource that InVideo provides is 24-7 live chat support. If you have any issues or you have questions with creating your videos through InVideo, you can simply click here to start a live chat with InVideo's support. So what we're gonna do is minimize this. Now below colors we have folders and if we click more we have access to stickers, overlays, shapes and masks. However because this is a beginner's tutorial we're not going to dive into each of these other elements down here. We've covered all the essentials you need to know to really get started and make the most of InVideo.io for creating stunning and professional videos in minutes. So remember, take your time to go through all these elements on the left hand side to customize your video. And remember you have layers on the right hand side and then you have your timeline down here. Now, if you make a mistake and you want to undo that mistake, all you need to do is navigate up here and where the arrow points backwards, this is where you can undo your last change. Now, all your changes will be saved automatically. Now, when you're ready to download your new video that you just created, all you need to do is navigate over to download and share. 
and then come down and ideally you want to download your video in the best quality full HD high definition so click here and then come down and click upgrade in order to download your new video in 180p high definition and remember to use the code Stuart25 to get a further 25% off your plan and once you upgrade you'll be able to download your video if you want to download your video with a watermark just to see how it's going to look go ahead and click 720p and then come down and click export and just like that on the left hand side you will see a preview of your video then when you're ready to download your video go ahead and click download now if you didn't upgrade to a paid plan there will be a watermark However, if you used our code and you did decide to upgrade, you did find value out of NVIDIA for creating business videos with ease, then you'll be able to download without a watermark. Now, before we finish up with this tutorial, it's important to note that NVIDIA has a strong Facebook community of more than 25,000 marketing experts and video creators that you can seek and get help from. So what I'll do is add a link down in the description below that will take you to their community group that you can join if you want to get further information, advice and you want to upskill in terms of creating and editing videos. However, this is everything we wanted to cover in today's beginners tutorial. And there we have it guys, that is it for this video tutorial designed to help you get started with video marketing and create your own professional videos for your business. Now if you have any questions about nvideo.io, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this video all the way through to the end. If you got value, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to this channel. And that way I'll see you in the next video. Take care guys.